Hey guys, I know it's been a while. I've been doing some traveling and been busy with work, but I'm back. I wanted to come to you guys today. Uh, Benefit has a new uh, pour professional product. Uh, it's called Agent Zero Shine. And then I was going to do a comparison, like who did it better, the Agent Zero Shine. I can't get that out. And then the regular uh, professional that we all know and love. So I usually typically use Smashbox Primer. And I was running out of it, and I was kind of in the market to try something new. So when I went into my local Sephora, I noticed that they had the Agent Zero Shine. So I said, let me try this out. So just to give you a little breakdown, it, uh, it comes in a little bottle like this. It screws off the top. And I'm just going to pour it on my hand just so you can see. But on the front, there is a screw top. And it's to open and close. And I don't know if you can see that. But I don't spill it all over my computer. But I guess what you're supposed to do is, which probably would have been a smart thing to do, dump it in <laughs> the little top here. the little top here so you can see that there and then on the bottom there's a little brush that you, it's retractable retractable I have shark kitty here of course as soon as I start filming here she comes give me one second guys a little brush you can take it Load your brush up, and then powder away. Now, it goes on colorless. Now, I'm pretty red bone, and I use it a couple times I was just to make sure, because for whatever reason, in my old age, this area right here turns into a grease spot by the end of the day. And I have to put some type of primer on or whatever makeup I have is gone by the end of the day and my eyebrows are gone. Eyebrows gone or they're like disintegrating. So I don't care what type of brow, whatever. I've been using Anastasia Dip Brow, which is fabulous. It does not budge for anything. But on my greasy forehead that I can fry chicken off of, it goes. So, um... I have to do something to prime my makeup in that area to make sure that it stays all day long or at least stays most of the day if I might have to just powder myself up late afternoon if I'm doing something that night. But it lasts, you know, through the work day. So, um, so that's the Agent Zero. The Pore Professional is very basic. Um, it's oil-free, lightweight, um... I think more for the other one is more mattifying. Um, this one's translucent, kind of silky um, finish, and it comes out like a brown color, and then it just kind of goes on clear like that. Now, which one do I like better? I'm going to stick with the Old Faithful. I think this one is good, but... It not for people of color. It it just doesn't. It looks ashy up under my makeup. I'm not using cheap makeup. I tried it under two different types of makeup. I'm sorry. I have Shark Kitty here again. Two different types of makeup, and I use my Lancome, which is not cheap, and I use um, a drugstore makeup, and it still made me kind of look ashy. So. Sorry, Benefit. I'm going to stick to the Old Faithful and do this one. I think this will work for some people, so I'm going to keep it. Because, you know, Sephora, you can take stuff back. I'm going to keep it, throw it in my kit. It may work for someone else, and I may try it on a couple of other clients. Maybe if um, their skin's not as oily as mine, then it might work. But it didn't work for me, guys. So I'm going to stick to the, ta-da, that one. So that was a quick review. I hope you enjoyed it. Talk to you soon. Bye.